So over a hundred thousand Ukrainian soldiers have been killed. The Russians have taken out their power grid all over the place. The people are freezing in the middle of winter. What do Ukraine get out of it? They get to join NATO, that's it. Now, if you ask the Ukrainians if they want to join NATO, what would they say, I wonder? Would they say, oh, it's worth 100,000 dead? It's worth freezing through winter? I don't think they would. I think they'd say it was a stupid idea. And so who gains out of it? Well, let's look at Zelensky. In February 2022, Reuters news agency were calling him the most corrupt leader in Europe. And now let's, let us look at the Hunter Biden, all the corruption that is alleged to have happened between him and Ukrainians. I reckon Zelensky's got the Bidens by the balls and he's squeezing hard and saying, you send me $50 billion, I'll send $40 billion of it back to you. It's all about corruption. That's it. Zelensky doesn't care about the Ukrainians dying. He doesn't care about the Ukrainians freezing. The Bidens don't either. They're all just corrupt ass bloody goblins.